Hi, it's Gene, retired in Mexico. And if you're new to the channel, we ask one question here, which is, do they write them and sing them like they used to? A lot of people, young and old, they think the old music is better, and I'm not so sure. But I, to tell you the truth, I'm starting a new series today, and I want to explain this briefly. Um, I like music from all eras. And what we're going to do is my favorite 133 groups and artists. So may maybe it's a vanity project. You guys can decide. Uh, why 133? That's just where my list stopped. Those are the groups that I really care about. I know it's a random number. So we'll upload three of these a week, or at least that's the plan. And uh, you guys will let me know if you like the ser series or not. But I love uh rankings and i love uh best of lists and i've loved them for years and i finally decided i wanted to do my own so you guys are going to get a window into what i really like but here's the thing to keep in mind and this is really important i have a lot of music on here from before i was born in fact from artists who died before i was born so i'm going both directions How there we go. <laughs> go. I, I have big hands. Um, go in both directions. Uh, going back before my time and going to the 21st century. And then there'll be some classic artists in there. But most people, they like the music they grew up with in high school and college. And I go both directions. And I also like uh, international music. I like country western. I like the blues. I like jazz. I like a lot. So the and and rap music too. The one bias I have on here is I, I just I don't have any metal bands. My favorite metal band is Metallica. And uh they didn't quite make the list. Um that's a bias. I am not that big on uh show tunes and Broadway. So those are kind of my weak spots. And then uh, maybe some uh, American indigenous music, which I have some playlists of that, but I don't return to it very often. It's hard for me to get into. But anyway, this is number 133. And this is a band from, and I'll tell you if I have physical uh, copies of any of their music and if I've seen them live. So let's talk about the criteria real quick before I jump into this. One is I made 80 minute playlists and I will put the link in each video to an 80 minute playlist that you can play if you want. So I'm really ranking 133 playlists and this eliminates people like Elvis Presley who I couldn't come up with 80 minutes of music, Aretha Franklin, people that are really great artists. But I just couldn't, or or bands that didn't weren't prolific enough. Television, a band I like a lot, but they really only did two albums and then they folded. People like Eric Clapton that just never, uh, you know, he did a lot of one-offs in his career. And then uh, just how I feel about the band. Do I page through and and read the articles in the magazines or do i skip that article um you know have i read a biography i've got some biographies up here there's one uh some behind me here and in, in, in my other room and then the other is a live experience if i've seen the group live i'll let you know and that um affects how i've ranked these people on the list if they put on a really good live show they get a little bump so number 133 a rap group from philadelphia pennsylvania american rap rap group two men that met in uh, high school at an art school and now have had a regular 15-year gig on national television those two people that met now go by the names of Black Thought and Questlove. And we're talking about The Roots. The Roots are my number 133 band. I love them. I have one CD of theirs. And I have been selling and downsizing. But I have Rising Down, which is maybe my favorite album by them, just because I own it and I've listened to it the most. But I also love Phrenology and Things Fall Apart. Um, 
things fall apart, I had an alternate cover, so it was worth a little bit more. But I think I took it down to the record store here to sell it. Yeah. I had the cover with uh, the boy on it. If I find a picture of it, I'll upload it here. And uh, I like that album, Things Fall Apart, quite a bit too. So that's my number 133. I've talked long enough. Hit that like or subscribe button if you like what I'm doing. Uh, comments are welcome. And as we say here in Bonita, Mexico, buen dia. <laughs>